If you are getting error messages like this when you try to import Astra theme, then this is the video for you guys. Hey guys, it's me, Rwana, and in this video, I'm gonna show you when and how this error message comes and how we're gonna fix this. So keep watching this video. Okay, now let's take a look at when and why this error message comes. Well, when you uh, try to use a free uh, web hosting from company like Infinity Free, as you can see on the screen. So I'm installing a WordPress a script and uh, you go to your dashboard of your WordPress, as you can see, and here you install your favorite Astro theme. Okay, you select your favorite page builder, you go to e-commerce tab. And first problem is when you try to import your favorite theme, you stuck in this process forever process simply close the tab and refresh the tab this is the first problem uh, usually people face okay now go back to that theme and try to import it and let's see what happened update fail so this is the main problem guys now close the tab and open up install plugin page and here try to activate woocommerce plugin and let's see what happened okay this is the main problem guys this error message comes because of the missing file of woocommerce plugin okay so now go to your infinity free uh, dashboard and open up ftp details and use filezilla as for ftp client and uh, login into your web server And here the all of your website files go to htdocs and WP content and then go to plugins okay and here you can see WooCommerce uh, folder and I want you to download WooCommerce plugin as a zip file from official website I'll provide you the link in the description box of this video of this plugin so that you can download this plugin directly from that link download the file and open up your download folder and extract the file now I want you to drag and drop entire WooCommerce folder into your plugin folder like this. I want you to select the same option as you can see on the screen. And this process may take some time. So I'm going to speed this video up. So WooCommerce plugin uploaded successfully. Now I want you to go back to your plugin page and try to activate it. But before let's refresh the tab. And now I want you to activate this WooCommerce plugin. So here you can see plugin is activated successfully. Now let's refresh your tab and go to your e-commerce theme and try to import it. And let's see what happened. Alright guys, as you can see, we have successfully installed this theme and the problem is gone. So thank you so much for watching this video and I'll see you guys next time.